I think the old cliche of a game of two halves, it was probably for us. Um, I think the first half we've done well, we've been on top and we've been the better team, but we've not necessarily punished them. So I think they've come out in the second half, have conceded from a set play and never really got ourselves back into the game from that. So I think it's been a bit of a frustrating first half of the season for us. Um, performances have been up and down, they're getting better, but you know we still need to pick up the results. We know that statistically the second half of the season that we, we do get stronger. So. We knew that if we could keep ourselves within touching distance of the top going into the break, then we'd give ourselves a good chance. We've had a few people missing through injury first half of the season and I'm sure that they'll all be back fit um, with a good kind of break under their belt and everyone will be back refreshed and ready to go. And I think the more players that have been getting game time now, um, I think Lucy Staniforth will be a, a big player for us after the break. Obviously, she's had such a long time out through injury and she's been picking minutes up now, so I think that'll be a real boost for the squad. It was kind of strange because I felt first 45 minutes I thought we played well. Uh, not necessarily football-wise, wasn't maybe the prettiest to watch, but I thought we were pretty much camped in their half. Um, and we went in at half-time thinking, OK, we just need to, to get that goal and then hopefully it will settle us. Um, but we didn't really come out second half. Um, they were a bit more determined than us, maybe. Um, and then it's, it's another set piece and it's a bit disappointing to concede a goal like that. Um, but you know, the second half of the season is when we normally come good and we're not giving up this title, no way. You know, we've won the last two. Um, so, yes, we've only got six points from the five games, but we've got a game in hand. We win that. I think teams will drop points and I think we can put them under pressure. No, I mean, the past few games, I think we've been unlucky with the result. It's not that we've played poorly. I just think we just need to be a bit more clinical in front of goal and obviously better defending. There's a lot more games in the second half season, so obviously we're going to be focusing on those and kind of we don't need to focus on the start of the season, just kind of winning them games and hopefully it'll take us back to champions. I really thought we we deserved to win that game. Um, it just I thought we I thought we we you know maybe missed some opportunities that we that we should have put away. I think at halftime we all kind of were thinking, man, it should be two nil, three nil at this point, but. Um, yeah, and I, I think we, we definitely, I think, played better in the first half. And then the second half, we, we, we sat, sort of sat back a little bit more, and, and that allowed them to get a little bit more confidence. And, and I think with, um, with football in general, and definitely with women's football, you'll see that most of our goals are happening from, from set pieces, corners, and free kicks. So they're certainly very dangerous. No matter who you're playing, um, you really have to defend well and also be ready to um, to score goals off of those as well when you get the chances. So, um, yeah, so it was disappointing again to, to kind of uh, concede on, on, a, on a corner, but um, at the end of the day, you know, you got to put balls in the back of the net, and if you don't, you're going to lose. So, um, I think that's something we, we could really concentrate on for this break is just, uh, um, you know, our final third play and, and continuing to just keep everything, uh, you know, tight in the back.